Guys, uh, welcome to the Bayonet at Puppy Creek in Rayford, North Carolina. I'm still the head golf coach, David Sinan at UNC Pembroke. And with us, we have our number one player from Brown Summit, North Carolina. She is a senior and she's graduating in May. What is your name, young lady? My name is Ashley Thompson. That's awesome. I did know her name, obviously. But today we're going to demonstrate bunker shots, the technique, what to think, what to feel. And we're going to get into short bunker shots and long bunker shots. First, we'll demonstrate a short bunker shot by Ashley Thompson. You'll notice Ashley has a lot of loft on the club going about middle of first stance. Most of her weight will be forward. Very nice. One of the keys to sand game is you cannot be scared. You cannot be timid. You must aggressively and accelerate through the sand. Lots of loft, weight forward. Very nice. When you hear that thump, that means you have done a good job contact wise. You'll notice that she'll keep most of her weight forward. This is not a normal shift your weight back. She'll keep most of it forward. Excellent. Now we will attempt some longer shots, often called the hardest shot in golf, the long bunker shot. She'll go less loft on the club, still keeping her weight forward. Little ball first there. That was not her best, but we are in the green and we're putting. We're still good. We'll try it again. Excellent. When you are in a bunker, the number one thing to do is get out of the bunker. If you are in a bunker more than one shot, we definitely have a problem. Excellent. That was awesome. She keeps her hands forward, always accelerated, and she is not scared at all. Another tip that we use at UNCP Golf and is often, often used growing up as a kid is how to properly hit a bunker shot. This is one of the strange shots in golf where we're not going to hit the ball first. We are purposely going to hit the sand first. That is how you hit a sand bunker shot. We will demonstrate the old dollar bill trick. Very popular with the kids. Ashley, go ahead. This demonstrates that she won't hit the ball first. She'll hit the area around the ball represented by this dollar bill. That was wonderful. It's basically the path of her club represents where that dollar bill was. With the game of golf, just like in life, not everything's gonna go your way. Sometimes you get bad bounces, and sometimes you get bad lies. It appears here that Ashley has an awful lie, but she hit it here, so she's gonna have to deal with it. Tough luck there, Ashley. What Ashley will do is keep a great attitude. She'll go with probably lower loft, possibly, get more upright with it, and do whatever she's got to do to get it out of this sand. It's a tough spot to be in. Once again, Ashley has found trouble. She is in a tough little spot. We're gonna ask her how she is going to deal with it. On this shot where your feet are outside of the bunker instead of being level inside the bunker, the ball's below my feet, so I wanna make sure I'm level and stay level throughout my entire swing. And then the rest of the stuff is pretty much the same as a normal bunker shot. Sounds great. Let's see what she can do. Oh, that's great. Get in. Great shot, Ashley. Guys, thank you for today. I hope you learned something about bunker play, how to get out of it, how to deal with bad lies. Once again, the number one thing is to get out of the bunker. 
and even before that, never enter them. Just want to thank you for today. Go Braves! <laughs>